Hey everyone, Meg here with IT Stamping and today we're going to be doing mirror stamping. So we're going to be doing this because on our die set and our stamp set, the brood for you, our cute little beer mug only has the handles going one direction and I want it to go the other. So we're going to fix that. To do that, we're going to need our stamp apparatus and also our silicone mat. You can use the silicone mat for so many things, but especially for this technique. So the first thing I want to do is go ahead and start by picking up my stamp uh, from my stamp apparatus. And the next thing I'm going to do is place my silicone mat on top. I'm going to slide this over so you can see what I'm doing. I'm going to ink up my beer mug in my black ink. Move this back and I'm going to stamp it once, pressing down really good on that silicone mat. Then I'm going to repeat that. Stamp it twice. And now I'm going to bring in my white cardstock. Remove my magnet, but not shift to my silicone. I'm going to take this and I'm going to add my cardstock over the top. Use my magnet and stamp. So the reason we want to stamp again, and I didn't re-ink, but the reason we want to stamp again is because then we're going to have our stamped image on both sides that's going to line up perfectly. All right, so now the other one we just get to stamp as normal. So it doesn't matter as much. I'm just going to take this, ink it up, flip it over and stamp. All right, so now we're ready to fill our mug. We don't need the mat under there anymore. Pick up that stamp. I'm gonna ink it up with crushed curry. We're gonna flip it over. Now we're going to remove our magnet, and this time we're gonna flip it over. We will need to realign our stamp. So then we die cut this one, and then we die cut this one, and it's gonna give us this right here. But this one is also gonna have the color on the back side. That's all there is to reverse stamping. That's cool, isn't it? I love this. So all you need is your stamp apparatus and then a silicone mat. All the supplies are listed in the description, so you've got quick links to everything. All right, so now let's take this and make it into a card. So I'm gonna start with my card base, and on top of that, I'm gonna add my pattern paper. Then I'm gonna add more pattern paper flush to the top of that yellow pattern. Next, we're gonna add our happy birthday sentiment on top. Then we're gonna take our two beer mugs and overlap them. And just like that, we have our adorable card. Now, if you like this video and you want to see more like it, make sure to subscribe to my channel, I Teach Stamping. Also, make sure to head on over to the I Teach Stamping blog to find out more about this project and also to make sure you are on my email list. I don't want you to miss a single thing that I send out. Again, I'm Meg from I Teach Stamping. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.